What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the fourth match here with Just Guy Del. Uh, yes, we won the die roll, and we would like to play first. Uh, yeah, this is a great opener. Uh, we have turn one Delver into turn one, turn two Delver plus Draven. Um, we have removal as well. Uh, the question is, I think, I think we get a steam vents. Yeah, let's go ahead and get a steam vents. That way we can get a basic planes if we need to. Next turn. But let's just go ahead and get that Delver out there and see if we can start beating down. Um, let's take the stop off of our opponent's draw step. Forest. Basic forest. What could that mean? Essence Warden. Is this some sort of like Soul Sisters type build? Not sure exactly. And I don't really want to I don't want to make this trade. So what I'm going to do is play another Delver. And I am, just to preserve my life total a little bit, get a planes here. Alternatively, I could have um, kept up the fetch uh, to use it as a, a kind of scry for the first Delver and then maybe try to flip the second Delver. Um, I think I'd rather just flood the board and start attacking. Fast. Is this some sort of brew that I'm not aware of? Rest the redeem. Create a one on green. Yes. Yes. All right. Uh. Now we're in business. Let's go ahead and swing in there. And our opponent is going to be on quite the clock. We have Path, we have Remand. Sure, they can activate Wrists. Not really too worried about that. Uh, I think I'd rather just make sure I Remand an important 3-drop here. Um, sure, they can gain some life as well. What, what is their second ability to do? I mean, free to token control, create a copy that's a token. I imagine they'll at least attack with Riss here, because that doesn't seem like a creature they want to be blocking with. Yeah, I'll uh, go ahead and remand that. Get another Steam Vents. And then I'll keep beating down here. Sweet. Now I'll have Snap Remand. Again, not attacking with wrists here. Uh, interesting. So this, I guess, this is like mono green elves. Uh, kind of like a slower build though, with wrists. Yeah, like I said, I'm just gonna do my best to out tempo them here. Again, they don't attack with the wrists. Not sure why. I'm gonna go ahead and path the the wrists. And we should have basically lethal next turn. Uh in two turns we'll have lethal. And this is the power of Delver right here. Um especially in multiples. Now if we had a bolt. We would use it. <laughs> we would definitely use it. Uh, no bolt, but we have snap remand, and then um, snap path on our turn. Let's see, does this have? It doesn't have reach. And doesn't have haste, so uh, not too worried about that exactly. This is gonna give it a uh... sure. Let's go ahead and crack this clue. 
another Snapcaster mage. Um, again, doesn't really matter. Uh, opponent is basically dead. Great. So, mono green elves. I've actually seen this type of build um, when I went to a tournament. It was like two years ago, though, so it's it's obviously been a while. Um, I don't know if uh, I don't remember if Collected Company was out then, so it's it's really been a while. Um, Pulse of the Alliance doesn't seem great. I think Remand also not fantastic here. Um, again, I don't know if they're on Cord. I don't know if they're on Collected Company. Um, so right now, I think Click is not bad either. Maybe cut a Geist, because Geist doesn't do a great job at um, getting through uh, a team of elves, basically. And they did have a lot of 3-drops. The only issue is if they like go turn 1 dork, and then turn 2 3-drop. Um, so maybe Remand is okay. Overall, though, I'm going to go ahead and run it back. I think, I think we generally have a good matchup here, and there's no need to like overthink it or over-sideboard. And if we see something in game two and then, that we end up losing uh, to, like a collected company or a cord, um, we'll, we'll adjust accordingly. Um, but we didn't see a Cavern of Souls, or at least not yet. So... This this may be like budget elves, so we'll we'll see. But overall, oof, got a lot of bolts. No second land though, so I'm gonna go ahead and mulligan that. Uh, yeah, that's a keep, and yeah, I'll I'll, I'll keep the third land because we have a snapcaster mage. So sweet, so we get to land uh, a delver on an empty board, and then we can hopefully play the tempo game from there. A lot of Orin Reefs. Some Swarded, sure. Uh, no, I do not want to reveal Geist. Uh, I also don't want to attack. Like I said, I don't think this is a very favorable, favorable trade. I think this will deal a lot more damage in the long run than Essence Warden will ever er, deal to us. This decision would die, put it on the bottom of its owner's library instead. Alright. Oh, shoot, shoot. No, nah, man. God, I was. That was a misclick. I was supposed to bolt in response to the Warren Reef. That's okay. We might be able to race it. Not not at this at this rate we're not racing it. No. Let's go ahead and get an island. So Geist, I mean, like I said, if I had landed this Geist on an empty board, we might be in a better position. Right now it looks like we'll have to send two burn spells at each of these creatures, which um is gonna be very annoying. So we kinda need to find a path to exile. Um, this is why I don't really like Geist in this matchup. Um, this is one of those things that wouldn't happen in real life, but does happen on Modo, which is, yeah, very annoying. Um, at least this still dies to, to Bolt. Hmm. Interesting. No. We'll go ahead and play another Delver. Uh, not really flipping them, unfortunately. Um, that's those Orin Reefs are are pretty good. Uh, here is where we'll Helix the Elvish. Attacking with the Nissa yet? I kind of want them to, right? <laughs> it's 
Still no attacks. Okay. All right. All right. Come on, Delver. Let's uh, let's flip whenever whenever you're ready. You know, no pressure. <laughs> that's that's the thing with Delver in a build like this. Oh boy. Yeah. So we would love to find a path to exile. Really, very soon, this Elvis champion's gonna be what a four four. Still no attacks. This gives us time to maybe find something. Nope. So I guess we'll stop on our opponent's draw step. And here we'll kind of represent both path and bolt. And here we'll see what our opponent's playing with, and then we can maybe start getting aggressive in the air. <laughs> Windstorm or Elvish Archdruid? Uh, I think I'll take the, this is the elves, right? Yeah, <laughs> I think I'll take the Archdruid. Uh, and leave them with Forest and Windstorm. And if they want to use Windstorm right now, they can be my guest. I believe they played the Forest they had, so now it's Windstorm plus Unknown. Uh, still no attacks, which is good. Path to exile. Oh, baby. So I think I want to get really aggressive here. Uh, and I'll path the uh, Nissa. And I'm going to swing out. And our opponent can windstorm. We'll still be left with Snap, Inspector, and Geist. Yeah, so this is at least 3, 6, 9, 13 in the air. I guess they gain a life every time the, the angel enters the battlefield. Oh, is Windstorm an instant? Probably should have paid attention to that, huh? Windstorm is an instant. Okay. Uh, you live and you learn, right? Huh. I'm starting to think I took the wrong card here. Well, now I just feel really silly losing to a card like Windstorm. Um, Alright, that's another land. Good sign for us. We should still be in a pretty good shape here. Uh, Mana Leak, pretty very dead here. Let's just get aggressive. Taking 9 damage a turn. We'll go ahead and set a stop on their draw step. And run out the second click. So I felt bad that I was losing both clicks. Um, uh, that, that I drew both clicks, but uh, now, now after that windstorm, the dust settled. Wow. Okay. Our opponent's a bit flooded. Yeah. All 
Yeah, uh, I don't I don't see us losing from here. I think this matchup is generally a very good one. Um, and I also don't think this is the best version of Elves out there, of course. Um, but they did get very, very flooded, it seems like. <laughs> right. Yeah, um... <laughs> That's that's the mono green elves matchup. Uh, you might see this at your like your local F and M. Uh, I went to um, it was like uh, SCG Baltimore way back when, and I played against this build. Um, it's definitely not the most competitive elves version out there, but it is one you may run into. Um, not at the top tables, but maybe at your local F and M or like side events and things like that. So um, hopefully you were able to learn something. Um, from this match here, and especially in terms of like Windstorm, I did not realize what kind of blowout that would be against our deck, especially as an instant. Um, so, thanks for watching, that was match four, and I'll give you one more match after this. Uh, so stay tuned for that, and I'll see you guys soon.